Well, this song is based on a completely true story. It's dedicated to anyone who has ever sent an email and then regretted it. I guess it's never happened to anyone here. You know, we have some friends whose name I won't mention that have made a pact between their uh, married scenario that neither one of them would send any emails on Ambien After Midnight. Well, this was an email scenario kind of gone wrong, and it went wrong in my direction. It was one of those scenarios where somebody meant to uh, send an email to 14 other people involved in a business deal that went wrong, and instead they forgot those other 14 people sent that email directly to me when it was about me, and it wasn't that nice. And I looked at it and I said, you know, I think they meant to send it to the other 14 people and leave me out, but I'm always good for a joke. So I copied that email to the other 14 people and the original sender, and I said, oops, I don't think this was meant for me. <laughs> and by the way, I was never rude, blah, blah, blah. Goodbye, have a nice life. And uh, five minutes later, you know, at the peak of this person's enormous <coughs> embarrassment in front of all of their colleagues and their boss, I got an email where the subject line said, my huge mistake. And you know, I was having a good time. I went on a second cup of coffee. I thought, oh, well, I'll read this. And I looked at it, and immediately I said, I'm printing this out. It's a reggae song. I printed it out. I took it to the kitchen table. I got my uke out. I'm going. And the only thing that I changed was I turned the subject line into a refrain, and otherwise it is word for word the exact thing that came to me. So, you know, my thinking is, well, one day one of my buddies at NPR is going to use this as a commentary when they're talking about email gone wrong, and this person's going to be driving home from work. And this song is going to be playing, and they're going to slowly pull over to the side of the road and go, why does that sound familiar? <laughs> but they're never going to go after claiming their share of the royalties because then they'd have to admit that they were the person who sent that email and it's all mine. So here we go, a little tune called My Huge Mistake. I received an email that wasn't meant for me Though it said some things about me that I didn't need to see So I replied politely and it didn't take too long till I received another email that I turned into this song. <laughs> My huge mistake. I'm so very, very sorry. This email was obviously not intended for you. I was writing an internal memo, sent it to the wrong person. May I crawl into a hole, into a hole and die? My huge mistake. I could God that you were not at fault. Comments in my email message, they're not a reflection of my company, it was on me. <laughs> I regret what I said and wish that I could take it all back. My huge mistake, my huge mistake. 